Rose. <laughs> I'm Felisa Ford. And I'm Natasha Rachel. And together we are committed to a world where diversity is welcomed, appreciated, and accommodated. Felisa, why don't you show our friends how to use Microsoft Translator to create a diverse and inclusive environment for both students and parents? Sure thing. Let's get started. Microsoft Translator removes language barriers, bridges communication gaps, and it creates a world where our students and parents are welcomed, appreciated, and accommodated, regardless of the language spoken. Now let's look at Word and Office 365. After I open my Word document, I navigate to the Review tab. Then I select the Translate tab. This gives me the option to translate a section or the entire document. Once the document is translated, I now have the option to use the immersive reader and have the document read aloud or translate it back to the original language. Now let's look at the translator feature in the Edge browser. We're on the CNN Spanish site and have two options to translate this website. I can right click my mouse and select translate. Now the page is translated in my into my preferred language. Or I can select the translate icon in the address bar which provides a list of language options to translate this page. We also have the option to translate back to the original language. Now let's look at the translate feature in PowerPoint in Office 365. To get to the captions, I navigate to the slideshow tab, select always use subtitles, select spoken language, and select the subtitle language. Now I select the location for the subtitles. I will choose below the slide. Now as I present my PowerPoint, the captions are shown below the slide in the language I selected for all participants. Unlike PowerPoint Live, however, participants do not get to choose their captions language. Now let's look at the Microsoft Translator website. We can join a conversation or start a conversation, which makes it easier to communicate with students and parents. To join a conversation, we enter a custom code. To start a conversation, we select one of the three options provided. We have the option to use this website in the classroom with students or in a general setting with parents. Now let's take a look at the participants view. As you can see, students are able to communicate with their teacher in their native language. OneNote Live supports students with access to the content and removes language barriers, so students are supported in a manner that best meets their needs. Once in OneNote, students can navigate to the section they need, navigate to the View tab, select Live Captions, and enter a join code provided by the teacher from a Microsoft Translator conversation. Then select the language preferred for captions. The student sees the teacher's lecture conversation captioned live in the preferred language inside of OneNote. The live captions are automatically saved by date in the transcript section in OneNote. As we see, these Microsoft Translator features help remove language barriers and communication gaps by making students and parents feel welcomed, appreciated, and accommodated. Let's all commit to a world where learning is accessible.